Hey, what's up guys? Mill Skull here. Welcome back to Terraria episode 125. When we left off, we did some more chalka mining and did some work on the tower. Um, I took a couple minutes off camera and I'll tell you guys why right now. This let's play is dragging on. <laughs> I know, I know, it's been over a year. Um, but yeah, I've done some off-camera work because I'm, I'm trying to figure out what what I exactly want to do to finish this Let's Play. Um, and my goals are still the same. I want to get this tower finished. Um, I don't necessarily think I'm going to move everyone in uh, because this alone would be a lot more work than it's worth to get the tower to 100% filled with everyone. Um, so we might change this up. I know it's the original the original junkie house. I said, it doesn't matter if it's symmetrical because I'm gonna take it down. And you know what? I'm still gonna do that. And we're gonna make some refined apartments. Um, still think of an, uh, thinking of an idea for that. I did make a discovery though. So it's, um. 1 16 a.m. right now uh, I woke up at about midnight <laughs> and when I woke up at midnight the first thing I thought was with Orichalcum that's been actuated can I place back wall because it's technically a four like a regular block turned into a back wall but it doesn't count as a back wall um, we'll get to this stuff in a minute so I tried it. Came up here and I saved you guys a little bit. Now you see this little white border around it? That's actually dynasty wall. So we have a dual layer back wall. There's one issue though. Um, here I'll show you. Because I saved a little bit for you guys just so you could see that I'm placing blocks behind that orichalcum. Now, here's the dilemma. Let me finish this up because I will forget. Um. I said, okay, cool, maybe this can be a room now, right? No, can't be a room. Do you know why? Because Orichalcum's a block. It counts it as a block. So even though you can walk in front of it, uh, let me grab something real quick and show you guys. So even though you can walk in front of it, it still counts as a block block. So you can see that the dresser is redded out. I can't place it can't place it anywhere because that's acting like a regular block. It'd be the same as if you tried to place it here in this wall. It counts it exactly the same. Uh, which is interesting. Why do I have a regular mushroom on me? That's disgusting. Ew. Um, so yeah, that's interesting. And it got me to thinking, what can I do to remedy that? What can I do? I don't know. I absolutely don't know. So we have this big awesome plantera um, right here. I wanted to zoom quick because I got some stuff to show you guys. But no way to use it. <laughs> now I could cut some of this out and make, you know, room for furniture and whatnot, but I don't know. I don't know. It would have to match up with this right here. It, it would have to keep this look. Unless I did something fancy here. Probably a three block layer is my guess. Um, but I don't know. It's it's tough enough finding pink blocks, let alone uh, pink blocks that match up with Orichalcum. <laughs> so yeah, that's the thing. Um, also, I took down... I took our enchanted sundial. Or I moved the other things. And I did some work right here because with this unusable space, I was thinking about what I, what can I do? What exactly can I do? So I started filling it with mud. Um, grab some mushroom seeds for me to plant some around because I do want to check it out with you guys if I can. Uh, and yeah, I know this is a separate one. I'll do that. Okay, that should be all of them. I hope. I think. I don't know. 
don't know, we got plenty to spare, so. So yeah, I thought, hey, let's make some interest, interesting little gardens. And, uh, yeah. Then I started doing this. And then I started looping it around and doing weird stuff because I can. Because it was, uh, it, it inspired me. Let's just leave it at that, right? There we go. That should all grow up nice and nice and strange how I want it. And then I started going, hey, let's let's get some of these hallways figured out. So I placed some blocks. Um, and I came up with these little shapes here that I think we can place some mud in. Not much, just enough to create a little something, you know? Something like that. That'll grow up nice and interesting. And here. That one, because I don't think it's going to grow. But yeah, um, let's just finish that one. <laughs> it's one more. I've got plenty of mushroom seed too, so. And an unlimited supply of mushroom. Um, yeah. So, that's kind of what I've been doing off camera is this kind of stuff. Uh, thinking about the Plantera situation. The Plantera bar. Uh... I could put some wood paneling, because like I said, it is inspired by Plantera. It's not going to be an exact, and I've pretty much made it not exact, but very close. Um, but yeah, I started closing off some of these because I said, well, we need hallways for this main tower, because it's really hard to get around. Um, and yeah, I just, you know, started doing some of the legwork that I got to figure out anyway. Um, this hallway, so this was all empty, all the way down to here, I think. And I just kind of started making the hallways, and it started closing the areas off, which I think is really cool, because we could kind of do some weird gardens and stuff in there. Same with here. Um, but yeah, it's pretty sweet. Gives me a little bit of place to do that. And down here, this is kind of the test, because I'm kind of thinking I want to do something like this, just tangled and looped around in different weird, you know, shapes like that. I don't know. I think that's a thing. I think I'm gonna do that. Cause yeah, it's pretty interesting. And I grabbed the vine rope and the sky blue paint and a paintbrush because I want to do some vine stuff, but um, I might even do that off camera because really it's just like this. So you place a vine you paint it blue. Sky blue. That's it. That's it. That gives that mushroom vine look. Um, but yeah, I want to do that. And I think I might do it in some of these taller areas uh, to start. Maybe here. Maybe we'll get something going on in here. Well, we absolutely will, but I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? Is that a cool idea? So that's something I should uh, start doing off camera is do some of this stuff. I mean, I don't know. I'll leave it up to you guys. I'm going to um, take a break from this for a little bit because I'm still kind of thinking about the ideas. But um, but yeah, it's, it's a long process to get these to grow sometimes. Sometimes a really short process. Like look down here, this is done. It's done. Okay, that should grow. Let's just give it a little boost. Right here, and here, and here. Perfect. And here, and here, and here. Okay, um, so yeah, the tower is taking a much different shape now. Uh, it's starting to look more alive, and I kind of dig that. And why does that look like it has such a... W oh, because it's mushroom block. That's why. You can kind of see it's just one shade off blue. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. So yeah, that's kind of what I've been up to. Um, I've been thinking about this too. The wizard's t the wizard's balcony. Do we need the wizard's balcony, or should we just make a hallway here and close off this area more? Um, I do like that I got a big tree out of this, and I chopped down some of the little mushroom just to see if we can get more big trees in here, big mushroom trees. Um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, let's see, I moved the imbuing station over here for flasks. And I moved the 
Uh, there was a bookcase here. I just threw it in here. For... T because. Just because I did. That's what I did. And yeah! Oh! Um... There's another spot that I wanted to look at real quick too before we get on to today get on to today's activity, which is trying to get Santa to move into my world. Um there's also this here. I'm not sure what I want to do here. Cause I kinda like this glass look. I want some of it to stay glass, you know. Uh I don't know. We'll we'll worry about that later. Okay, let's come down here. I think I've had enough uh Enough of that for now. Got too many torches. Let's just throw those away. Quicky stacky stack, and you, and you. Beautiful. Okay, yeah, let's zoom out. Let's play some Terraria. I'm thinking I want to go for the Terrarian today. Um. And some uh, fragments, because. I haven't really given it much thought. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. What am I exactly doing? I'm going to put this dresser away. That's what I'm doing. Okay, so right here. And you. Perfect. So yeah, um, let's go gather up some stuff. What do I got? 60 Stardust Fragments. Dang, I could probably make a... I have the Luminite, since we couldn't use it for that build. Um, summoning set. Do I really want to go there? Hmm. I do, but I'm kind of, I'm kind of digging the solar set right now. Let's um, let's focus on getting the Terrarian because that's what I really want. That's you know my one of the goals for the series. I also want to get Santa. Gosh, I should do a Santa thing. Um, okay. Let's think of a really easy way to get Santa. Or a banana ring. Nope. Garbage. Ooh, presents! Okay. Um, we're not gonna get too excited about that. See, I need some wood. There's plenty over here, but... Yeah. I want this to be nice and simple. Actually, you know what? You know what? I have an even better idea. I have an easier way to get Santa. It's gonna work too. You see me just passively like... Get out of here. Shoo. Go Muley. We're gonna get some brick and do it. Because I know I have plenty of stone, I think. I always say that. I never have enough. Look at all this junk. On star. Um, garbage. Oh, presents. Let's see, where do we hide presents? Did we hide any last year? I know we had some goodie bags. Nope. Okay. Let's go like this. Let's put presents here. That's a good spot for them. Okay. Santa's house. Santa's house. What are we thinking? Snow block. Snow brick. Okay, snow brick. A little bit. Okay. Cool. Let's go make some snow brick. I think Santa should live in the house. What do you think? This be a nah, I don't think so. He's only gonna be here once a year. Um, gosh, that looks so crazy with the blood moon. Shoo! Please, please, leave me alone. It's always a blood moon in this game. Okay, I say we just add on to it. Uh oh, I didn't read it. That's okay. I've died enough times. You guys should know I've died before in this game. One time. Hmm. Let's solidify right here. Let's just trash that one. Doesn't matter. Uh. 
I have another grave I placed out here earlier. It says something something nearly died by a vampire. This one, um, I'm gonna write. No clue what this one was. I was thinking about Santa. Uh, 2017. <laughs> oh man. Ah, oh, this is why I wanted wood. Because I wanted to make a second room. Or another room up here. I don't know, do we even have room for Santa? How many NPCs do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Am I still missing like four NPCs? That includes Santa. Hey, money trough. Nice. Oh, I don't want to add to this tower of yuck. Maybe it, you know what? I think I'm going to keep that tower. It just... I don't know. We'll just build some rooms. Uh, the way I know how. Top hat. I already had a top hat. So, Gilbert. Buy this, buy this. Buy this top hat. Is this armor banner? Um... Wooden arrows. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go like that. Then I'm gonna grab some... It's gotta be wood. It's just gotta be regular old junky wood. Doesn't it? Yeah, we have to. We have to. I don't want it to be like that, but... We really don't have much of a choice. I love this forest, though, for some dumb reason. Let's go over here. Um, okay. Okay, you're done. It's the only green forest left in this game. We'll leave those two. Just for, uh... They look good next to the rail, that's all. Nothing special. Get some trees. How much wood do I have? 115? That'll make a house. That'll make four rooms, because that's what I'm thinking. So we just go like this. Nice and easy. They're huge rooms. And I know they're off center. That's okay. Santa's a goal. Santa's a goal for me. these rooms have to be fancy. Nope. Nope. I think uh, I've done everything there is to do in this game. <laughs> Pretty close. Except for a class playthrough. But you guys are not gonna get that. Meanie Muley, jeez. Broke my heart when you said that. I know. It's okay. I still love you. It's all good. It's, it has to be wood. I mean, like, I hate wood houses, but at the same time, this started out as a wood house, so gotta kind of keep the theme, right? I'm almost out of wood. Jeez. Whatever. Let's just do it. I should start a wood farm is what I should do. Makes sense. I should just chop down my woods, but... These trees are the best. So, like, I selected these trees, you know? Like, they had to have tops. They had to be tall, you know? Or, like, they just had to have a certain look. So, because you get those ones that, like, the tops all cut off. It just looks like a big giant stump. I hate those trees. I should be selling this junk. 
All this junk. All but the presents, of course. Vanity, boop. Um, we've got everything else, right? Pretty sure. Not you, Jack. I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to the Dryad. You don't sell wood, do you? Ah, of course not. Sell. 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 Nothing important. No portal guns. Okay, we're good. We are good. Okay. That's a thing. Um, gosh, I need wood. I need to go and, like, focus on this. Where can I get wood that's still green? And isn't... Corrupted. That's a tree. That's a tree. Okay, we're going that way. Come on. Boop and boop. Okay, off we go. No, I like that forest down there. I don't know. It just... I hate seeing trees with the tops chopped off. <laughs> like that boreal one, but that's boreal. I need regular old junky vanilla wood. And this one. And this one. And this one. Those are all trees I hate. See them? This don't look good to me. And this one. I could... I should have made it boreal. That's what I should have done. Oh, we are getting people. Did he die? Is that why? Hello? Ah, this is why. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. We got trees here. Let's let's just uh, smash them. Oh, jeez. They're far away enough from home that... Uh, I really don't care. And I'm trying to keep pumpkins too, because that's two Halloween's worth of pumpkins. Ah, oh, such a nice place. We'll take out the... the stumpy trees. Traveling merchant, shade wood. Okay, I think we've done what we can do. I didn't replant. That's okay. Look at this. Prime prime real estate for a tree farm. And I'm not doing it. I have a campfire. Got like your campfire. Oh gosh. Where are you going? Where are you going? I just want to see. Uh, if it kills some torches, whatever, right? I'll work on that another day. We're gonna come up here and uh, get a tree farm going. Do I have any dirt? I'm sure, I got dirt at home. Oh, duh. Can't do it that way, Muley. Hello, wife. Okay. Dirt. Never thought I'd hear myself say that. And... Acorns. I have eight acorns, but I'm gonna buy more. Just because I can. 22 acorns. That's a good tree farm start, right? Just for the old vanillas. I need grass seeds too. Or a... Let's see. This guy. Ooh. Staff of regrowth. Creates grass moss on, on dirt and stone. This is alchemy plant collection when used together, which I never do. I never do. That's bad newly. Is this the place or is this the lake? That's the lake. Which means... There we go. There we go. Okay, what height are we at? Uh, let's take down this tree. I want to kind of optimize this farm a little bit. Um, water. What are we gonna do with you, water? You know what? I'm just gonna uh, flood the world a little bit. Because, why not? I do like the water, it's just. I don't know. It will create a little tiered something here. How's that look? That looks pretty good.
There we are. Boy, this episode's taken a weird turn, hasn't it? <laughs> Went from, uh... Like... Doing off-camera stuff to all sorts of weird stuff. I dig it, though. It's alright. A little bit of episode variety never hurt me, especially. So it feels like I get into the grind where that's all I do is Let's Plays. Yeah, you know, changing it up don't hurt. Beautiful. There we go. And then we'll just, uh, start over here. Tree farm. That way I don't have to keep chopping all my trees down. We might even do it here. We might as well, right? Let's just, uh, place some dirt. Which I don't even have to move the water. Dumb muley. Let's take the pumpkin down. Because as much as I like it, you know, it's... This has to become more of a utility space. I do want this, though. There we go. Beautiful. There we are. Staff of regrowth. Okay. Dirt. So yeah, I think I'm going to continue some off-camera stuff. Uh, try and get this Let's Play wrapped up because... I'm getting worn out. I'm sure a lot of you are getting worn out. Thank you so much for uh, sticking around this long. You guys really, really are so good to me. <laughs> Even though I can be stubborn and, you know, I'm, I'm pretty stubborn. I don't know. I, I like, I love doing Let's Play videos. It's like my number one favorite thing. I love that my series go on forever um like this is over a year's work and i it, there's still work to be done and i love that um i'm even learning new things like the back wall here never even knew that was a thing um that you could do like a double layer back wall like that and that's crazy for builders like um in spaces where you don't need furniture that's like a breakthrough that's crazy 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 good but yeah, um, uh, ooh, starting to grow in real good. Look at that. I'm thinking that's how all the dead spaces are kind of kind of look. So like right here, maybe we'll do something different. Um, we'll have water features. I do want to have some waterfalls. Like right here would be a good place for a little, just a little stream to go down. Maybe cut this one out and have it run down. Um, maybe right here would be a big waterfall coming down, you know. We'll do some cool stuff like that. I'll have to play around with it. Um, and yeah, show you guys my little gardens. Gardening with Muley. New series. Just me doing mushroom gardens. It'll be season three. Season three of uh, this Let's Play. <laughs> no, I, after this is done, guys, I'm, I'm done with uh, vanilla for a bit. Because as much as I love it, and I've done vanilla for years, I always come back to Vanilla Terraria. I think it's time I move on to different Let's Plays. Um, and I'm totally missing the point. I should be talking and building. Talking and building, really. Okay. There's a light. Because we've already got open fires in the house. So why not? Now here, I need pumpkin armor. What do all? Four doors. Four chairs. Four crafting tables. Oh no, wooden tables. They're cheaper. I do want to save some wood, so... Okay, let's uh, get this filled in. Very quickly. So yeah, modded Terraria. Um, don't worry guys, I already have an idea. I already have an idea. 
uh, I'm not going to falter from that idea. It's, it's going to be a good one. Trust me. I mean, just the fact that I'm saying modded is like a miracle. Because I don't... I, I told... I said... What was it? Last year? Maybe the year before. I can't remember. No, it was the year before. I said I will never play modded Terraria again. <laughs> Ever. And, um... Here I am, considering modded once again. Oh, we're get we're we're doing the thing I hate too. Our chairs are all stacked in the same direction, same location, everything like that. But you know what? How about this? That chair ain't even next to the table. This one isn't next to the table either. This one is gonna go here is gonna face this way. It's one of those guys that walks in and turns the chair backwards and sits like this. <laughs> uh, and let's be super ghetto about it with the torch. I just need NPCs to move in. I need all the NPCs because um, I do have rooms. I just need to figure out who I really want to move into the castle. Like what theme? I would love. To, I would love Blackbeard the pirate to move in. Um, Clothier, we could use some vanity. You know what, Clothier, for sure. What kind of space do I have? Ooh, Clothier. What about that? Give him the tower. <coughs> so yeah, that's kind of the future of this uh, series is. It's going to be building, and I do want Santa, and I do want the Terrarian, and there's a lot of I wants. Um... But yeah, we're getting there, guys. Just hold tight. Um, I'm going to try and make the episodes more value, though. So I'm going to do stuff off camera to show you on camera more often. Look at that. We got some tall tall ones right here. That's nice. That's what I want to see. I want to see more tall ones. I also want to see more interesting shapes like this. Because this looks cool to me. I don't know. What do you guys think? Um... I'm sure it's going to grow eventually, but I kind of want to just finish it. I don't have the stuff on me, though. Let's make sure we put this away, too. Remember I have that. I have to be reminded constantly. Oh, we missed a traveling merchant. Yep, he disappeared. Okay, that's cool. But for now, my friends, I want to do this. Um, I want to turn this into cloud. Unless it stacks here. Hey, look at that. Nice and easy, except for... My wood disappeared. Where are you? There you are. All but one, and boop. Alright, my friends. I want to thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope it had a little more... Um, relevance as far as content goes. And yeah... It's, it's still going to happen. We're still working on it. Um, I'm going to do some off-camera stuff more often. So the episodes might get a little bit weird as far as timing goes. Like you won't get one every one or two days. Maybe you will. I don't know. Because um, I'm really set on getting this series done. Um, but I don't want to just cut the series off and move on. Because that's not how I do things. I like to finish things. Anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you. Leave me a like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Tell me your thoughts. Tell me your ideas. Um, do you like this garden idea? The big gardens and crazy stuff everywhere. Like every little gap is filled kind of stuff. Um, also, give me a suggestion about this. If you can find a pink block that's this color on the minimap, let me know. Especially if it's back wall. I really want to know, because it has to be back wall, actually, so. But yeah, thank you guys. I'll see you next time. Bye!